official unboxing. Um, so we were able to get our hands on this little number. It's the NES made all out of Legos. So today we're going to unbox it. Um, I don't know if I will do a putting together video. This does have over 2,600 pieces in it. So it would take a very long time, but I'm excited to open it up, put it together. I've seen really cool videos of this all put together. And so I'm super excited. Um, this TV that they have on here is similar to the TV I used to play the old school Mario on. So it's like super nostalgia. <laughs> like this is what I used to play when I would go to my grandparents' house. Me and my siblings, we would sit in front of their giant TV having to crank the dials and we would run through um, Mario and it was always so much fun. So I'm excited to open this up, put it together and feel all that nostalgia just like rush back. So without further ado, we are going to be unboxing this NES Lego. Don't even know where to start. This is such a big box. Okay, it does look like there's tape on this side. Already things are falling out. So I'm thinking like the um, Super Mario Starter Edition. This also, like each package looks like it has a number on it. Um, if it's like that one, you will need the app in order to actually put it together. They have started to go away from the manual instructions and so you will need the app um, in order to actually get the instructions on how to put it together, but we will Figure that out once we start pulling this stuff out. So, so far, all of these have numbers on them. So, this one's 15. I will say that is very nice um, when you're putting it together. It will tell you what bag all of your stuff is in versus like the old school Legos, you literally had a box of all the Legos and you had to like rustle through to figure out which piece you needed. Ooh, that's a lot of like gray pieces. husband to help me out with this one. Apparently it goes all the way up to 21. So that's awesome. Gonna be a ton 
of Lego pieces. Let's put all of them to the side. So I don't want to see. I also did see that Lego was planning on going away from the plastic bags and going more towards paper bags. So that will be less noisy, hopefully. So it looks like we have some stickers to put on. I'm assuming that's for the cartridge. So I was wrong. They do still have a physical manual which is, this one is literally just the console with the controller and the um, cartridge. And then this one is the TV. <laughs> like, this is insane. <laughs> Look at all the pieces. That's so cool. This one has 242 pages in it. This is definitely going to be a beast to put together. So it does say the starter, of course, is needed um, to really make it go. And I think it's mainly because of the Mario that's in it. Um, you can actually put it on the top of the TV and it'll actually play the music for you, which is really cool. Yeah, this is neat. I am super excited to put this together. And same thing with this beast. Jeepers. Now I have heard that the controller is a one-to-one -one comparison to the original. Um, the console, on the other hand, is not, as well as the cartridge. But it'll still be cool to kind of like see how it truly compares to what I remember. Um, unfortunately, we don't have an NES to compare it to, but I do have a um, Super Nintendo, which was a similar size, so we might compare it to that. Um, but anyway, stay tuned. There might be some clips of us putting this together. I definitely don't know if I'll be wanting to do all of this on camera, but we'll see. Um, anyway, we will definitely be doing more unboxings, so make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. And feel free to leave me any comments in the comment box below. If you would like to see us put it together, let me know. Um, but yeah, I'm excited. Um, and stay tuned for other unboxings and other videos. I'll catch you later. Bye.